Hello once again everybody, welcome to J Wex Health. Topic of conversation this week, what you need to do in the middle aged years to prepare yourself for retirement. As people tend to age, they tend to have a tendency to eat less, thus consuming fewer calories, but also more importantly, consuming smaller amounts of vital nutrients that their body might need. Also, as we age, it becomes more difficult for the body to absorb and digest certain vital nutrients. For good health over the age of 50, it's extremely important that you eat good nutrient-dense foods and that you remain physically active. Your body changes as you get older. Your muscle mass decreases. Your body fat has a tendency to increase. You need fewer calories as you age because your muscle mass decreases and your metabolic rate also declines. However, moderate amounts of exercise can help preserve muscle mass. Regular exercise also keeps your bones strong, keeps you flexible and mobile, and also increases your sense of well-being. So an extremely good point here is as you age, Try to stay as mobile as you can. It'll do nothing but help you. There have been some recent studies on alcohol consumption that show that older adults who consume one to two drinks per day actually has some types of health benefits to it. Consuming one to two drinks per day can improve your mood and reduce stress. However, it is found that some older adults specifically ones that live by themselves, consume far more than one or two drinks per day. And obviously, that's extremely bad. Consuming more than two drinks per day in older adults obviously can backfire. One of the biggest problems is it winds up possibly filling you up and therefore giving you a loss of appetite. And as you age, you need uh, water, you need vitamin and nutrient dense foods and this alcohol will therefore be taking the place of those foods and the water and that's not good. So making good food choices and exercise can help you to pie age as you grow older. Now this is like a little part one. Next week, part two, I'm going to come back and I'm going to give you some, some supplements that you might need to take as you get into your older age. Well, thanks for watching. It's all the time I have for this week. I'm Jeff. Thanks for watching Jay Wicks Health. And I'll see you again here next week.